So, brought a bunch of guitars to church on Sunday, and uh, the telly won. That was it, man. Uh, the, the sound man, and the singer, and the bass player, and the pastor, <laughs> who's a kind of rocker dude. It was uh, unanimous. It really was great. And, you know, I learned a few things. So, so I'd been doing church for for a year with the FM9 and I sold it and now I have this and I will say I don't know you know I don't know which one's better or worse you know as far as like a lot of people say that the that the the FM9 uh, the fractal is like the modeling or whatever is a little bit better or some people say oh they like the top end more I don't know um, I will say I like the Helix floor unit better than the FM9. Hands down better. Um, I mean, the, it, it, and it, I thought that I was going to like it because of the, having the built-in expression pedal. And while that's cool, uh, the, the 12 buttons is, is the lights out. That's really nice. The way it's formed and everything is really nice. The FM9 is cool, but but the, the Helix is better. One thing I did notice cuz with the Helix with the with the FM9 I I brought the expression pedal once or twice and I was like, "Oh, forget it." So I just did church with you know, with the volume knob. So Sunday I was kind of like all excited. I got the Helix and I was like trying to use the foot pedal and then I was like kind of also still using the volume knob and a couple of times I thought the foot pedal was off. <laughs> the preacher was I'll never forget it. We were doing something it was an, it was an F and the, the 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 preacher was I just started praying and I went <laughs> And the worst of me looked over me. I was like, oh, man, sorry. <laughs> it's like, dearly, uh, you know, <laughs> nice echoey ambient F. But uh, <laughs> the consensus across the board was that this was the best sound I ever had. Now, I never used the, tel the telly. I'm also in a different headspace. Um, the Helix is nice. The Hislop patch is really nice it's just more appropriate i think it's like his knowledge of the genre you know is obviously far surpasses my knowledge of the genre so my programming of the fm9 was good but but he's really like i would never program this like <laughs> Like, I just don't, I would never think to like, hey, let's make it, but it really did work. We did Firm Foundation. We did a bunch of the, the bangers. And so, uh, you guys know I want to start singing. Now, my voice has been a little, 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 just not inspired sound. Like, I just haven't been singing. I mean, I, mean, I, I sing when I teach, but I haven't really been getting getting down on it. Get down on it, but uh, but um, I did uh, I've been like warming up and I've been watching these worship vocal coaches, which a couple of them I know. Um, one of them is is uh, Brett Manning, who's a friend of mine who I called and I talked to yesterday, and I said, listen, I I really want to start doing this and. I said, I'm just kind of at a weird spot, so we're going to get together. He lives down in Franklin, and we were personal friends. And that's his, he does a lot of, like, worship vocal coaching, and he does a lot of country, too. But but I started working on fir firm foundation, so a couple of things. One, I'm going to be starting to do vocal videos of, like, warm-ups and working. I have a question who out there knows about this? Can I do, can I put covers? Can, can I put me working on a cover on YouTube and then just do the licensing so that they get whatever residuals? Can I? How's that work? Where do I find out? Who do I talk to? And, and I demonetized my YouTube about two years ago. 
But what's weird is I'm getting commercials now. It must YouTube must have changed its protocol because even though I'm demonetized, now all of a sudden there's commercials on on, our, on my videos. So, yeah, how's that work? Can I, like, if I wanted to do firm foundation? Cool, huh? Yeah. But can how's that work? I, I wrote down some notes here. Hold on. Telly One, Helix versus FM9, singing at church, ask about covers on YouTube. Oh, I was right on track. More singing videos, right? And the other thing, uh my client Scooter Page, there we have two songs ready to mix. Um and I got the okay today to shoot videos of it. So my buddy Rob Chandler, who's been on my videos, you know, periodically over the last 10 years, um, he's coming out from Ohio. Ohio. Or yo? I don't know. He's going to put the yo in the studio. And we're going to drop it like it it is hot and we're going to get jiggy with it. But he's coming out on the 19th of February, so like in two weeks, right? Week, two weeks. So I called up Scooter and I'm like, hey, is it cool if we shoot these videos of it? And uh, part two, can we do it like on the 19th, 20th, 21st? And he's like, yeah, sure. So um, I'm going to be pulling, I'm going to be doing them from scratch. I'm going to be pulling in the template from scratch. So... They're going to be long videos. It's going to be the, the real deal. It's not going to be like after the fact and me just opening things and going, I did this and that happened and this happened and that. You're, it's going to be watching the sausage. So there's two songs. So it may end up being like a, so, a video per and then take them out to the truck and then come back and maybe a video of like tweaks and finals and bounce outs and, you know. But... Yeah, but that's it. So that's where I'm at. You know, it's. Uh... Oh, oh, and then this. OK, so the girl, the girl that sings at church, she's not like the worship pastor or whatever, but she like she sings. She'll sing harmonies and do like one or two leads. Uh, you know, every few weeks she's been there. Uh, she's awesome. Killer singer. Super nice person. Um. And she runs a, a service at kind of, it's like a mission. It's called Emu, E-M-M-U, Emu, 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 like, uh, let me look, hold on. Hold on. Oh, what does she call it? Emmaus, E-M-M-A-U-S. I don't know what that means. But I did it once with her. And it's like they're serving food, and we do a little service, and we play a bunch of songs. Anyway, she, I, I asked her if she would come over here and watch me sing and play some tunes, tell me what she thinks, maybe help me make get the right keys. Um, but I'm going to be singing. So uh, we're both going to be singing, but I'll be singing on March 3rd. So like a month probably from from this past Sunday. So, and the ones that I've been working on, I've been, I, I wish I could do the firm foundation. But I can't play the, I can't play the, uh, I can do it like B flat. Anyway, you get the gist of it. So I, I want to know if I can work on these here. So and then here are the tunes. 
this is this is it. I know these videos are crazy. Yeah, it's this one by Cody Carnes. I love this song, "The Blessing," by uh, by Elevation. I also really love. There's a bunch of them. What a beautiful name it is. I mean, these are kind of the bangers. That's kind of what I want to focus on. Is is like the the the, the real commercial, real popular. Um, because I think that the new worship pastor at our church, he's more he's more of like an indie guy. He does like he pulled out a song for us to do on Sunday. It was so awesome, and I didn't realize it. He had produced the song. It was some artist he works with, and the drummer that sat in on Sunday was the drummer on the record. You know, and it's like it was almost like Elliot Smith, like kind of like vibey, atmospheric, droney, kind of slow, mid-slow. Um, I figured, you know, if he's get if he's into that, and I can contribute by, you know, being like Farmer Brown, you know. Do like a little bit more like... Plus, I like the popular ones because I want everybody to sing, right? I don't... Yeah. So anyway... So, videos are coming. Telecaster just. This is such a great combo. So I ordered the Helix bag. It should be here hopefully by Sunday. And then I've got the, the, the dual mono bag. And I just put my Epiphone in there. It's just going to stay in there. But there it is. I ended up not... You know what I ended up using it the whole time? Middle position. Right? Without the, the series. So like the standard, brighter. Where you go in series and it's more humble. It's cool, but you know, our, our church is like over a hundred years old. It's big, it's cavernous, it's got wood everywhere, it's big. Having a little bit like kind of like cutting in, not Peace. Oh yeah, how do you do covers on YouTube?